He sneaked us back in the house. Back in the house. Another video for tonight. So I just the off, didn't I? I? Didn't do a video. Right, this is a distribution that doesn't get enough love. No, it doesn't. Even though it's super duper, it does everything you want it to do. It's updated really, really regularly. But, you know, it just doesn't seem to get too much love. Okay. This is PC Linux OS. Right, if you've used Linux before, and you've used this before, you know how far back it goes. It's come from way back, and it's been updated and updated. But you never see it in the news or anything, do you? It's never, oh, this is the greatest distro ever done, and there's not so many distributions like it, really. And not many videos done on it. So tonight, I thought I'd cheat, okay, because I've run out of actually hard drives to install stuff on, too. So I'm actually running it from a USB stick at the moment. But I will install it over the weekend, because I found a spare one. It's only a 250 gig really old so but we'll install it and see how it goes but this is the live usb version so usb 3 by the way so it's nice and fast so it's the mate version or some of you younger people will say mate with your coffee you know what i'm saying yeah no it's mate all right m-a-t-e spells mate i don't care mate i mean it's like lx cute no it's lx qt okay there's a qt there it doesn't spell cute does it that's my rent for the month. Thank you very much. Okay, I'm going to give you a quick show round while we're here. I'm actually recording on it at the same time, by the way. So you'd get a little bit here, because I've got a rather large stick, so that's okay. So being mate, you get applications, places and systems. A bit like the old school stuff we all liked and loved from years ago, okay? And you can see, just to fool you, I put sneak here, but I'm actually in as a guest account, okay? So I'm not going to lie to you. But it is on my full system. So if I go to terminal... You'll see it comes up as guest, okay? But I'll put in H-top there, H-top. And you can see for real. Now, because we're recording, it's using rather a lot of RAM. But as I've got 32 gig in this machine, it doesn't really matter, does it, really? I've got plenty to go around, if you know what I mean. But when you install it to the hard drive, it won't use that much. You really need to install it and get it right for your hard drive and your system before it will go down a bit. Now, bearing in mind, it might only use about 300 from scratch. Yeah, 300 maybe, something like that. So there's no no compies here, look. It's just a window, okay? That's all you get. But it's only 1.4 gig to download. You can get the Mate desktop, or Mate, you can get KDE, and there's some uh, user ones that are available that are okay, super duper. Sometimes they work, sometimes they don't. You used to get two different versions. You get the big version and little version, but you don't get that anymore. But hey. That was the old days when I had more brown hair, even. Okay, applications. I'm going to leave HTOP open for you so you can see. Under more applications, you get assistive technologies, HTOP, we've got open, the mate terminal, power statistics, I'm going to say that, and virtual box, X term. Okay, archiving, it all comes with it. I'm not going to say that, but you get simple burn as well. Under configuration, you get lots here to configure for your system. You see what I mean? I'll open the NVIDIA display settings for you, so you can have a look. Okay, this is, it's a real system, yeah, it's real. That's a, not a lie one. So this is my GeForce GTX 7, 9, sorry, 970 even. So, all run on PCI 3. So it's super duper. Yes, of course I want to quit. I want to show you something else. Going down. Development. You don't get too much. An icon browser and Libra. Should we look at the icon browser? Why not, while we're here? It's not actually doing too much. Oh, oh, in places we get some, but yeah, okay. That's one why you really need to install it. Okay. Oh, here they come. But you really, really do need to install it to get the full force of it, really, to be honest with you. So that's what I'm going to do over the weekend. I hope the drive ain't too old, actually, because I think it's about 10 years old. Editors, Master PDF Editor, Pluma, File Tools, Bleach Bit, Bleach Bit Root, be careful when you use these, because sometimes you'll end up with no free space. It will just disappear. Kaja is a file manager. Should we have a look? Let's look, Kaja. Might as well. Will it open? Yeah, opens okay. Okay, you can see my other drives here as well. Okay, next on the agenda, shall we say. Graphics. I won't go to games, because there's only one, and it's a card game. Graphics. I have mate for viewing your images. LibreOffice Draw, which comes with the LibreOffice Suite, so I don't need to go with that really, do I? Mate colour selection. Other people have done this before, so I'm not going to bother. And take a screenshot. I'll take a screenshot. Let's have a look. Okay. 
grab the whole screen. And just, oh, I'll have a two second delay. Take a screenshot. And we're done. Where do I save it? I'll set the desktop. Save. There it is. So it all works. It's super duper. Don't worry about it. Under internet, you get Firefox as your default browser. Pigeon for messaging. Qubit Torrent and Chunderbird. And I've got the Dropbox integration. I think it's an old version, actually, though. It doesn't look right. Okay. Under Office, as I said before, the full LibreOffice suite. So that's okay. Oh, go back. See, I ain't got used to this mouse yet. It's so bloody sensitive. Key pass for your passwords. A tool for documents for your PDFs. A make calculator and a make dictionary. I hope they make dictionary, maybe. Look up. Dad. That should come up with taxi driver. And it doesn't, see? See, I need to adjust that because dad is dead taxi. Okay. Well, close. Okay. Next. Okay, software center. Uh, dupe clean GUI. Be careful when you use this also. That's in any distribution. Synaptic is your package manager of choice here. And it's updated really, 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 really regularly here. Okay. I won't. It is really regularly updated. Sound. Okay. This is where I got a bit confused. Clementine, pulse for changing your pulse stuff, of course. Sound for changing the sound of volume, which is the same as pulse. And Spotify, okay. In sound, I could understand that, okay. And VLC Media Player, which of course you need to do your videos, of course. And in video, we get Clementine, but we do get OBS as standard, which I'm recording on now, okay. I've not installed anything to this system whatsoever apart from OBS, otherwise, my stick would blow up, of course. But we also get Spotify and VLC again. Okay, so I've got Spotify. It's just a basic Spotify client, I think, at the end of the day. Yeah, I'll log in with me. Okay. Okay, and it wants my password. You don't know what it is. I don't think I do either. Oh, no, I do. There we go. It comes up nice and cute and clean. Okay. What have I played recently? <gasps> A wolf Alice, okay, a bit of Carlo, a bit of Trevor Nelson, Ooh. Room 5. I still don't like Spotify, unfortunately, it's just not for me. I like the physical disc in my hand, and my wife giving me £10 to go and play with in HMV on a Saturday, okay? I like it, okay? She gives me the £5, I go, thanks wife, I'm gone, later, bye. Okay. Off you go. Anyway, that's basically what we get in the applications, but this is out of the box, okay? Out of the box. And you can see the CPU's not doing anything really, and you will need this sort of stuff to do it 60 frames a second, is what I'm doing it from a USB stick. Okay, you will need it. Okay, yeah, I've got a good processor, not as good as the other one, but it's okay. Yeah, that's the job. Should we have a look at the screenshot? Let's have a look. Open the screenshot in GIMP. Oh my god. We're loading up, and there's my screenshot. It's all right, see? If I drag that up, it works all hunky dory. But you really do need to give this distro a go because it is very reliable. And I should have used it more back in the day, really. I really should have. But go and give it a go, even if you've just got a USB stick. Just give it a try, you know. You may like it. It's one of the most unloved distros out there at the moment. Everybody goes for Buntus, Fedora, etc. Arch this, Arch that, Sabion this, and Gen 2 this. No, 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 no. PC Linux OS. Go give it a try. Sneaky Linux out. Asilas, bye bye.